Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Abby, and I know it's been a minute since I've been here, but I'm sorry, a lot has been going on. So for today's video, it's definitely going to be a chit chat, get ready, well not get ready with me, but kind of like a chit chat video so I can talk to you guys, let you guys know what's been going on, where I've been, and catch you guys up to what I'm doing now, okay? So first things first, um, yesterday me and my boyfriend celebrated our one year anniversary early. Yes, it wasn't our one year anniversary, but we did it early because a lot is going to be going on in a few weeks. And I did this makeup look and I was like, girl, look good. So today I've just been in the house chilling, relaxing, recovering from yesterday. So I just decided to just come on here and record that look for you guys because I loved it. I was so surprised at how it came out. And yeah, so we're just going to go straight to the video. Um, first things first, I've already, um, first I've already moisturized my face with the Simple Hydrating Moisture moisturizing moisturizing lotion um i've been using this for a couple of weeks now and i do like it it doesn't let my face oily or grease or anything like that it's a great balance of moisturizing my face <laughs> and um i've been going back and forth on using the rimmel london stay matte primer and the neutrogena shine control primer on its own with both of these it's kind of like a love-hate relationship. I'm not really sure if I'm... I don't know what to say about it. It's because, like, when I use both, like, individually, I still get a little oily. So yesterday, I just decided to put both of them on just to see if it'll make a difference. And it did, but maybe because of the activities we were doing, maybe that's why I got a little bit oily quicker than normal. But I'm not really sure. So I'm going to keep doing the combination of both of these just to see if it really is a better combination option than them on this on its own and i am sticking true to this mary Kay satin lip lip balm if you guys have not tried this i tell you this will save your life i love this lip balm like my lips have been so moisturized so soft and i just love it like where was this all my life literally especially like when the cold months come up which is about to you know been a couple of months like this is going to be a lifesaver to a lot of people especially me because i do have drying lips which sucks right because it's like my face is super super early but my lips are drying i don't know but anyways on to the makeup so i'm just going to do my eyebrows and talk so anyways like i was saying the past three weeks have been busy. Three weeks ago, I got a job, which I was super, super happy about. I also decided to go home for a few weeks. So me and my boyfriend drove his car all the way to Ocala to visit my mom, hang out with her. And um, we went fishing, which was so so fun like my boyfriend has never went fishing before and we grew up fishing we we're always outdoors everything like that so i just decided that would be an awesome like mini vacation i also vlogged it so if you guys ever want to check it out you should definitely check it out on my channel <laughs> so anyways when we came back um i had to um go to training for my job and um, orientation and things like that. So I have been really, 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 really busy with my job. Also, I just purchased a car. Well, not purchased a car, but I have a car now. And I'm so, so happy because that is like a huge, huge step for me. Um, well, just with anyone in general because it's a huge purchase, it's a huge responsibility, and I'm just so, so excited that I was able to get my car because that was the one thing that I ever wanted. Well, not the one thing I ever wanted, but I, you know, I was ready for a car. So, I was so happy that I was able to do that. So, now I've just been really, like, trying to get everything settled. 
um school is literally like monday so this past week i have been like going back and forth to school trying to get registered you know getting my classes in that type of headache if you guys are college students you know what i'm talking about it's a headache and it's just been like really really busy lately um so yeah i've been busy with that and it just seems like the days are just going by so quickly it's so crazy it's like one moment i was just like laying in my bed i'm just like oh i have like like six more weeks till school start and i woke up and it's like school is like monday it's just it's crazy how time goes by so quickly so yeah i'm gonna clean up my brows with my la girl pro conceal in the color toffee i love this stuff it is literally like my holy grail concealer for highlighting cleaning up my brows everything seriously so anyways yesterday my boyfriend surprised me with a um what am i trying to say so yesterday my boyfriend <laughs> surprised me with a um i'm gonna say a helicopter with a with an airplane tour around the city of miami and when i say i was surprised like that i i really I didn't know what to say. I was speechless. I was surprised. I was shocked. I was like, oh my god, like, are we really doing this? Like, for one, I've never been in an airplane before. At all. Okay? So, we're driving. Well, we made it so crazy. I was driving. And I was just like, well, where are we going? And he was just like, oh, just follow my directions. Okay? So, I was like, alright, whatever. So, I'm driving. And I see, like, an airport. And we're turning. I'm just like wait where are we going <laughs> and he was just like oh don't worry about it just keep going just park the car just let's go so i'm just like oh my god like so so nervous because like i said i've never been in an airplane before i didn't know where we were going i didn't know what we were doing i didn't know anything and then we get out and then we walk to the place we meet the guy and then you know he says oh you're the couple here that's um, going to get the airplane tour around the city of Miami and I was just like wait what we're doing what oh my god y'all when I said I was so happy I was so excited like I could not stop smiling the whole way there it was just crazy I put this concealer all over my eyelid to prime my eyes for the eyeshadow that we are going to be doing then I'm going to take the Rimmel London stay matte and I'm going to set the concealer on my eyes. And this is just going to give us a nice base for the makeup. And I know some people, they just put the concealer on their eye and they don't set it and they just you know put the eyeshadow right over it um i tried that before maybe because it was the color i forgot what the color was but it didn't really show up that great so i was kind of like okay well let me try to set it to see if that would work the color kind of shows a little bit more better more brighter and it just works better like that so that's what i'm doing okay so yeah just like this and for the uh, eyeshadow, I went and used the Maybelline Blush Nudes Palette. Use the white shadow in the top corner. Where is my brush that I used? Oh, it was this one. Okay. And another thing that I found, did I find it or have it? I don't know. I've just been doing it lately. I've just been spraying my brush with the elf makeup setting spray to make the eyeshadow a little bit more pigmented and it's really been working however 
it doesn't really last that long so i don't know maybe it's because of the makeup spray or what i don't know what it really is i just pat this all over my eyelid just like that So anyways, like I was saying, so, you know, we're on the airplane, we're flying in the air, the takeoff wasn't that bad, so I was kind of like, oh, okay, I'm perfectly fine, I can deal with this, and it was just beautiful, you guys, like, seeing the city of Miami from, you know, like, an airplane view or whatever, it was just, like, the best view ever, it was just, it was a great experience. Like I said before, I've never been in an airplane, so I kind of felt like that was like a great first experience of being in the airplane and stuff like that. It was great. And afterwards, we went to Bahama Breeze. I love that restaurant. Their food is like the bomb. I think I had the lobster, the shrimp lobster. The shrimp lobster linguine pasta dish, I think it was something like that. It was like bomb, y'all. It was so good because it's a light color. You don't really want to blend it out all the way. You just want to lightly blend it out. And then I'm just taking that matte brown shade and I'm just using that as my transition color. So, yeah. So the next color I'm going to take in that e.l.f. palette is like this purple mauve color. It's a matte shade. And I just added that in my crease. So anyways, after we had left Bahama Breeze... We had went to go see Straight Outta Compton, which was so good. Like, if anybody hasn't seen the movie yet, well, I mean, I know it just came. And that's the thing about it. I didn't even know the movie had just came out. Like, I was like, why are we going to see a movie now and it just came out? Like, I don't like to go to the movie theaters when a movie just came out because I don't like when a movie theaters is like super super packed like I had horrible experiences at the movie theaters when it's like a thousand people in it like people are talking they're eating they're just loud I'm just like can y'all chill so I can just watch the movie in peace because that's what I paid my money for but you know that was like when I was in Orlando so I don't know Orlando Miami people are different but whatever but um the first movie theaters we went to, the movie was like sold out. We went to go see a movie, the movie at, um, I think it was like around 10. I think it was like 10 o'clock and 10.20. And it was sold out. And, well, the 10 o'clock movie was sold out, but the 10.20 movie only had seats like in the front row. And I was like, oh no, uh-uh, we ain't. We are not sitting in the front row and have to look up at the movie. No, I did that one time. It was like horrible. My neck was killing me the rest of the day, the next day. And I was like, I will never do this again. Luckily, it wasn't too far, the next movie theaters. So we drove to another one. And, um, you know, the 10, I think it was like the 10 o'clock movie we went to go see. No, it was 1020. The 1021, it wasn't sold out or anything like that. So I was like, okay, perfect. Let's just get it. So the guy was like, oh, it's not that many people in there, whatever. A lot of people are going to go see like a later movie. So I'm like, okay, perfect. We go and it's like packed. I'm like, how are you going to sit here and lie and say it's not packed? And it's packed. Like when I say packed, it was packed. I was like, I should go get my money back. But luckily, I found a seat up in the top row where I love to sit at. So I was like, you know, I'm not going to complain because we had a good seat. You know, this movie just came out. So I was like, okay, I got to kind of be reasonable with these people. But don't lie to me. If it's packed, say it's packed. <laughs> but one thing I did not know. That movie was long, y'all. When I say long, I mean like Jurassic Park long, okay? 
We got in there at 1020. We didn't leave till like after one o'clock. Okay. I didn't even realize how long it was. I was just like, <laughs> you see what time it is? <laughs> it was long, y'all, but it was worth it though. I definitely will tell you that it is definitely worth the money and the hype that people are saying about it, to be honest with you. Um so yeah. I'm just, you know, going back in with that mauve shade on the fluffy brush to blend it in some more. And then I'm also gonna go and mix that mauve shade with the a matte black shade. And I'm just gonna add that directly like in the corner of my eye to add more depth. So I'm just going to go back in with that brown shade, the brown matte shade, and just blend out the top of the edges with that purple, well, of the purple, just to soften it up because it is kind of like, you know, like a dramatic smoky eye in a way a little bit, but, you know, we don't want to be too dramatic like, bam, what's up, we here, you know? <laughs> so that's why I'm just going to soften it up just a little bit. Because we still want to look super girly and cute. I'm going to take the white shade and we're going to add it to our brow bone to highlight the brow bone area. We're done with the eyes for now and we're going to move on to the face and I am still rocking with Maybelline matte matte and poreless <laughs> foundation in the color coconut I'm just going to do one side at a time just to let you guys know And I'm just stippling in the foundation. Okay, so I'm back. I got my travel face going on with my highlights. So you know the drill. Blend it out with my trusty fingers. And yeah, so my camera died. Well, I keep saying my camera died. My camera didn't die, you guys. My battery, my memory card, that's what it is. I have like only 20 minute memory cards. I have like five of them though. And it's so crazy, like I found them <laughs> when I was back home and I was like cleaning up, going through like old stuff that I have for like years and years and years. I've had like a total of like maybe five cameras, digital cameras, and you know, obviously I have memory cards for them, but I had totally forgot about it when, you know, I started doing my YouTube channel and things like that, and I was just only rocking with this one memory card that I had, and I was so thankful that I, I had found them. I was like, oh my god, I don't, have to go, I don't have to go buy anymore. I was so happy. So yeah, like... And 20 minutes be going by so quick, like, literally. So that's what's, what's going on today. I guess I'm talking a little bit too much. <laughs> but it's okay, because I haven't been here in, like, forever. And I, like, missed you guys. Like, seriously, I missed doing my videos and stuff. Oh, and, like, the main reason why it's been a while 
since I've been recording makeup videos it's because my face had like a broke out so bad y'all when I say bad like it was like the worst. I was just like, oh my god, I do not want to be on camera with my face looking so bad. And it really took like a long time for it to clear up. And it's finally clear up, but um, I do have a little bit of acne scar dark marks that I'm really trying to get rid of. Um, it's not as bad as it was before. I have a piece of hair on my face. Okay, yeah. It wasn't as bad as it was before. It's like ugh, a lot better now. But before it was just like crazy. And I was not about to get on here and do anything. Like my breath was just like, girl, what's wrong with you? You ain't recording this video? I was like, no, boo. Mm -mm. Mama can't do this. Not today. <laughs> so, yeah. Shout out to the boyfriends that support. Woo woo. So yeah, I'm going to take my Rimmel London Stay Matte in the color Transparent and set my highlight. And lately, I've been really wanting to get some new brushes. So hopefully, I do that really, really soon. It's just... I don't know. I always thought, like, once I get a job, I'll just have, like, all this money that I can just spend and do whatever I want to do. Life was like, oh, no, boo-boo. Responsibilities was knocking out the door. Like, uh, you got things to take care of. So, you know, I have to be an adult and be smart with managing my money. And gas is like... Where you think you're gonna go? So yeah. But don't worry. I just kind of feel like things will fall into place in time and when it's needed. So now I'm going to contour with my LA Girl Pro Conceal and Dark Cocoa. If I can squeeze this out. I always get scared like when I'm squeezing out the squeeze tube. That is just gonna like go everywhere and I just be like oh my god I don't want that to happen so I just kind of be like scared to squeeze it out so as normal I am going to contour the cheeks sides of my forehead or my temples then the forehead and that's it well for right now I'm going to contour my nose but I'm going to use it differently well not differently but with a different tool than my fingers so like always you just want to tap it in drag it down just a tad bit but also push it up okay Lightly though, because I'll be noticing that I think I do it a little bit too thick, and I just haven't been liking how it shows up. So I'm just going to take you know, just a fluffy brush and just blend it in. Black Radiance Pressed Powder in the color, what is this, Mocha? Yeah, Mocha. And I'm just going to set everything.
under my contour. Just like that. And then I'm gonna go back in on my nose just to highlight that area again. Just like that. So then now we're just going to blend everything together. Lightly though, because we're already kind of like blended in our contour. We just don't, we just want to blend out the harsh lines. So, you know, it's not a drastic like, girl, you got a contour going on over there. No, we don't want that, okay? We want it to look like her makeup is flawless, honey. So that's what we're going to do. Just like this. I'm going to put on some mascara, I'm going to pop my lashes on, and let me be right back, okay? Okay, so I added mascara to my bottom lashes, and on my lash line, I added the purple mauve shade, and then I blended it out with the brown shade. I also highlighted my inner tear duct area with that same white shade that we put on the lid. I also fixed my brows a little bit because I was not feeling them. I used the NYX lip liner in the color Never and I used the NYC, what is this, lip, ooh, it's a lip stain. And it's kind of like the same color, just I guess in a lip stain. <laughs> this is the completed look that I had did yesterday when I went out with my boyfriend so glad um, I came up with this look color I was so happy and surprised I was like girl look at you doing some makeup but yeah um so hopefully my schedule won't be too busy to take me from recording some more videos if anything then I would just you know pre-record some videos for you guys because I don't like I said before I do not want my everyday life to take over and stop me from recording um, makeup videos or just any type of video and posting it for you guys because that's something that I love to do and that I want to continue doing so I'm going to stick with it and I'm going to make sure that I post at least once or one or two videos a week you know what I'm saying so, thank you so much for watching my video. I hope you like it. If you did, thumbs up. Comment down below. Subscribe to my channel. And I look forward to seeing you guys in my next video. Like always, thank you so much. Bye, guys. Ooh, highlight on fleek. Uh, duh.
Duh. Mm -hmm. Strong. Boy, I highlight coming through, honey. You better work. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm. It's my little highlighted coming through dance represent um what's this called light glow stand up 